Alright, hello Mr. Niren here. Welcome to Dragon Ball Z Budokai Tenkaichi 4. It's a mod by fans of Dragon Ball Z Budokai Tenkaichi 3, a game from 2007. It's the most, um, I believe this game, uh, Budokai Tenkaichi 3, is widely regarded as the best Dragon Ball Z game. I believe Dragon Ball Z Fighters is the second one uh, after this one, so this one is still the most popular. Okay, and uh, I played it already back in like 2007 or 2008 on the PlayStation 2. It's a PlayStation 2 title. This is a mod, however, and uh, it's had a bunch of different releases. I never really played any of the Spanish releases. It's Spanish modders that have modded it. Uh, Latin American modders. Could be Mexican, Spanish, or maybe South American. I don't know. Anyway, Spanish speaking uh, people made a mod, uh, but it's been translated to English, this version. Most mods are in Spanish, but this one is in English here. Okay, so it has a bunch of new features. We have a new UI, user interface, and we have new graphics and new characters. We'll check the characters. We have a Goku early, or Son Goku. No transformation, we have a Kid Gohan. He can transform into a great ape. These are old characters, of course. We have Krill, and I believe also that some of the old characters have new uh, special attacks. They are faster and shorter. They are not as time-consuming as the old ones, and uh, are more intense and faster. I believe also that the battles are uh, have been sp speeded up, so when they fight each other, they move quicker than in the original game. Okay, we have Krill, and by the way, we will need to to that uh, so drill and uh, I thought about lowering the sound but uh, I changed my mind. Uh, so yeah Yamsha Tayan Shaotsu Yairobi all of them are old the male Piccolo Son Goku meet here he can be Super Saiyan Goku uh, Son Gohan Tingoan 
It'll be Super Saiyan and Super Saiyan 2. All of these are obviously old characters. They might have new skills. In battle. We have Future Gohan. Super Saiyan is Future Gohan. We have Future Trunks. Sword. And Super Saiyan Trunks with the Sword. Super Saiyan 2 Trunks. And Super Saiyan Rage, which is new actually. Then we have Trunks from the. I believe. Uh, after he had been in the time chamber with Vegeta, with Super Saiyan Trunks and Super Super Trunks. And we have Piccolo and Nail. With Goku, Late Goku, Super Saiyan Goku, Super Saiyan 2 Goku, Super Saiyan 3 Goku, and then Super Saiyan God Goku, which is new for this mod. And Super Saiyan God SS Goku. So I haven't watched Dragon Ball Super. I have read the manga, the 42 leaves, Dragon Ball and Dragon Ball Z. Then I have uh, watched at least the majority of the Dragon Ball Z, Saiyan Saga and Namekian Saga episodes. But I haven't really watched anything else. So I will need to watch the Android Saga and the Buu Saga later. I haven't watched Dragon Ball GT either. But I have uh, played a bunch of games with the GT stuff. Uh, and I played a few battles in, in uh, Tenkichi Tag Team and in Budoka Tenkichi 3 mods where they have super Dragon Ball Super characters. But I have never really read anything about Dragon Ball Super or watched anything Dragon Ball Super. I plan on maybe watching Dragon Ball Super. I have almost played, uh, I mean, watched all the, the movies, the old movies. I am at probably movie 13 or something. So I, I will finish all the movies. But I don't know if I want to finish GT. I hear it's pretty bad. I might uh, skip through the episodes and just check uh, who fights who and such. Uh, Dragon Ball Super on the other hand, uh, which is the official continuation. I believe Dragon Ball GT was a uh, continuation by the, the company that made a TV show, made a continuation of Dragon Ball that wasn't very good. Uh, while uh, Dragon Ball Super is an official continuation. Uh, that is much better in quality, as far as I hear at least. And it's uh, the modern Dragon Ball. So this mod adds a bunch of Dragon Ball Super characters here. Okay. We have Adult Gohan, Super Saiyan Adult Gohan, Super Saiyan 2, Ultimate Gohan, and Great Saiyan. They are all uh, old characters, but they have made the Great Saiyan an uh, evolution of Ultimate Gohan. He wasn't in the original, I believe uh, Great Saiyan was separate from the other Gohan in the original. Here is the final evolution, the strongest one. Okay, Kid Goten. He can turn into Super Saiyan, but not into Gotenks. Unlike in the original where he could turn into Gotenks and Super Saiyan Gotenks and Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks. I believe in, in this game they made Gotenks uh, a separate character. <coughs> Same with Kid Trunks, you can become Super Saiyan Kid Trunks. We have Vido, she can't transform into her uh, hero form. We have Mr. Satan or Hurtly, Vegeta, you can turn into Super Saiyan Vegeta, Super Super Vegeta, Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta, Super Saiyan God Vegeta, Super Saiyan God SS and Super S S S S S S G S S Super Saiyan God uh, whatever evolved. I don't know these transformations. I haven't watched Super. Then we have Vegito. You can turn into Super Sa Super Vegito and the new Vegito Blue. We have um, Kaioshin or Supreme Kai. <coughs> Gotenks is his own character. He can turn into Super Saiyan Gotenks and Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks. In the original he was also present but was a transformation of fusion of other characters. We have Kid Ub, we have Pickgun, we have Gogeta, we can turn into Super Saiyan Gogeta and the new Super Saiyan God SS Gogeta. We have Nadine Vegeta. Super Saiyan uh, Goku GT. 
turn it to Super Saiyan Goku, Super Saiyan 3 Goku, and Super Saiyan 4 Goku. Japan, Goten, GT, Super Saiyan, GT Goten. Ub, which is older than the other Ub, I guess. Tapion, Vita from GT, Super Saiyan 4 Evolved, Vita. Yeah, Vegeta from GT Super Saiyan 4. Mm -hmm. Goku and Ultra Instinct. Uh, Ultra Instinct Goku. <coughs> Miras. Okay, we have this character Kaba. Super Saiyan version. Kaba. I know that they are from an alternate universe, I believe. The Saiyans, the, the Saiyans didn't all go extinct. Okay, Kalifla and Super Saiyan Kalifla and uh, Super Saiyan 2 Kalifla. She is also new. And uh, <coughs> Kate. Super Saiyan Kate returns into a very masculine Super Saiyan form. And uh, legendary Super Saiyan Kate. She is also new. I don't know these characters as they are new. Super Dragon Ball Super. Uh, Kefla, another new character. and. Super Saiyan Kefla, she has the same hairstyle as Broly. Like a legendary Super Saiyan. We have Arale. Arale. She is um, the main character of Dr. Slum, another manga and anime. She is not from Dragon Ball or Dragon Ball Z or Dragon Ball Super or Dragon Ball GT or any Dragon Ball. So she is a bonus character, a guest character of this game. Made by the same creator that created Dragon Ball. Okay, Bardock. Father of Goku, and we have Super Saiyan Bardock. Instead of Ape Bardock, we have uh, Fasha, or Selfie. Her Ape form has been removed. We have Turles, all the Ape forms have been removed. Uh, Slag, we have also Giant Slag. Raditz, Nappa, Vegeta. So Vegeta is the only one that kept his Ape form. Great Ape Vegeta. In the original, all the Saiyans had big forms. <coughs> okay, Frieza, first form, second form, third form, final form, final full power, and golden Frieza. So you can have all, all the way up until like, two, three, four, five, six uh, evolutions. In the original, I believe they only had like three, okay, or four. A cooler has uh, and the uh, final form cooler. We have Ginyu, Captain Ginyu, uh, Riku, Berter, Jace, Guldo, so Ginyu Force. Then we have uh, Mecha Frieza, Metal Cooler, King Cold, Father of Frieza, <coughs> the Doria Sarban, he can transform into post transformation Sarban. We have uh, Frieza Soul there. This guy should be Pu Pu, I believe. But he may, he may have uh, the model of Pu Pu and the moves of uh, the Frieza Soul there. Who knows? That would mean he's weaker here. <coughs> then we have Hatchack. The villain of one of the movies, I believe. A movie that followed with the game. The uh, Dragon Ball Z Raging Blast, I believe. <coughs> Heaven Fortress, I used to own the game to him. I never watched the movie. Okay, Cell. It was a PlayStation 3 game. Uh, Cell in perfect form. Semi perfect and perfect. Okay. Ultimate perfect form has been removed. Okay, Cell Junior. Android 13. And Fusion of Android 13 is the old form. Uh, Android 16, Android 17, and Android 18. Android 19, Dr. Gero has been removed by the creator of the androids. Uh, okay, Magic Boo, Super Boo, Kid Boo, and the Bedabra, <coughs> King of the Demon World. Booyak full powers, we do not have uh, his earlier form here, we have only his final form. Janemba and his uh, Super Inemba form. We have Hirudegar. We have a new character here, Hit. Who 
Look at black, another new one with the upgrade Super Saiyan Rose. This new. Samusu, another new character. Samusu Fused, a new character. And Top, a new character. It is the uh, fusion or evolution destroyer form. Okay, Irian, Yiren, new character. The Broly, he looks different from previously in the old game. Super Saiyan Broly and the uh, legendary Super Saiyan. I mean, this is from the movie that I haven't watched yet. Then we have a younger version of Broly where he can turn into Super Saiyan Broly. And then legendary Super Saiyan, that's the original. Okay. Baby Vegeta, we have Super Baby, Super Baby 2 and Great 8 Baby from GT, we have Super Android 17, we have Shenron from the movie, that I still have to watch, Age Shenron and Omega Shenron, I believe that's the next movie I need to watch, <coughs> but first I believe I need to finish the new saga, I never did I believe. Uh, I need to make videos of the new saga, the final part, and then do the video with the Omega Shenron character, that's the villain. We have Tau Pai Pai, the only Dragon Ball character in, in this mod, except maybe King Piccolo, Old Piccolo, and Kid Goku, where he can transform the Great Ape, and <coughs> we have Kami Sinino, Master Roshi, can transform into Master Roshi, great power, and max power, I mean. And then we're back in the beginning. So we saw that we have a bunch of new Dragon Ball Super characters and uh, transformations from Dragon Ball Super. <coughs> and all characters have got uh, new, new moves, new special moves. Not all of them, but some of them. Alright, so this is the new character select screen. The new art. A single player to play spectator, spectator mode. Illusion C, you can play, you can buy C items and strengthen your characters. Dual mode, you can compete against your friends or the computer, or have the computer fight itself. Dragon World, world Tour, you can participate in various martial arts tournaments throughout the world. Time Nest, now it's time to protect history and bring back peace. Fight your uh, hardest in this challenge. Dragon History experience some epic battles here. Shenron mode, you can use the Dragon Ball to summon Shenron. Eternal Dragon. Options. Sunus Temple, Suno will introduce everyone. <coughs> Data Center. Use some use a replays and summon some of the multiverse's strongest fighters. <coughs> so soon I believe that was Bulma in the past, I believe. Ultimate training, learn how to move and how to fight and all the practice here. Okay. <coughs> All right, we can watch a few battles. Okay, custom. The new stages to planes. Planes night. <coughs> Come as look at. Come as look at night. Planet evening. Planet night. Planet night. The wasteland noon, wasteland evening, wasteland night, rocky area, noon, rocky area evening, and rocky area night. These are all stages. Uh, okay, planet Namek, agonizing planet Namek, dying planet, mountain road, noon, mountain road evening, mountain road night, islands, hyperbolic, hyperbolic time chamber. Glacier, Cell Games Arena Moon, Cell Games Arena Evening, Cell Games Arena Ruins, that's a new one actually. Um, 
this at night, this at evening, this at night. Other world tournament, that's new. Supreme Kai's world, hell. King's Castle, South City, that's new, I believe. City Ruins, that's old. City Ruins Evening, old. And City Ruins Night. So we have a new South City here, that's cool. City Ruins, probably imported from one of the older games, like Dragon Ball Z Budokai 3 or something. Believe that stage was there, could be wrong. Uh, okay, we have a. Uh, or it's made from scratch, I don't know. Archipelago, that's a new one. Archipelago Evening. Champa's Ring, new. Tournament of Power, new. Tournament of Power Climax, new. So these stages uh, were in Dragon Ball Z Burger I think it's a tag team. I mean, Dragon Ball Z Tenkichi tag team for the PlayStation Portable. I don't know if they have been remade for the PlayStation 2 title, the PlayStation 2 title has better graphics. I don't know. Yeah, it's the same stage as I saw in the Tenkichi Tag Team mode. Tournament of Power, Tournament of Power Climax, Tournament of Power Final, Velda Mount Pause, Under Space Up, and Under Space Planet Vegeta. Ah, I see, this is new too. So a bunch of new stages, and then we have a huge amount of new songs. We have a million different songs here. Like all the songs from Dragon Ball Z, Budokai 1, 2 and 3. We have uh, the Tenkichi 1, 2 and 3 songs too, and the, some of the Japanese songs. And the Raging Blast songs too. Didn't see, yeah. Uh, yeah, here it's Kama House. We'll take it as the stage Kid Goku versus Kamsin Nin or Master Roshi. Fit the battle. Some old Budokai music. Music here. You gotta take me on! I'm not holding back on you! Sure are strong. 
Alright. Go to Lost. But that combo there that we saw, it wasn't in the original game. <coughs> so they've added some new combos and stuff too. It's a very impressive mod. And the reason I believe that Dragon Ball Z Budokai Tenkaichi Zero has been announced by Bandai Dam Namco. So a new Budokai Tenkaichi game is coming. Named Dragon Ball Z Budokai Tenkaichi Zero. To be released for the PlayStation 5 and other modern consoles, probably for the computer and Steam too. I certainly will buy it on Steam for the computer if it's released on Steam. It's got a lot of mods and such. I, need, uh, I know uh, the PlayStation 2 game could be modded too, but uh, it's difficult to mod, if not impossible, to mod uh, modern PlayStation 4 and PlayStation 5 games. So you need a play uh, the computer version to mod it, I believe. This is a very extensive mod of the old PlayStation 2 title. Of course they needed to make it into a ROM and uh, mod it on a computer. Uh, but they have managed to put it back on a CD so you can play modded Dragon Ball Z games on a PlayStation 2, I believe. As long as you have a, uh, I believe a shipped version of PlayStation 2 can run um, burnt copies of the game. Okay. Could probably <coughs> change some settings around. Can have uh, transformations on. Okay. And we will have a team battle. So most of the Dragon Ball characters have been removed, like most of the villains and such. So we can't really have many Dragon Ball fights here. We will go straight to Dragon Ball Z after a few battles. We will let Goku fight again. No, we will go straight to Dragon Ball Z. Okay, so Goku. No, we, we will uh, let Goku fight some more battles. Good fight comes to Nin again. Now they can transform, so. Try again with the transformations on. Say music. You gotta take me on. I'm not holding back on you. Fight. Show me what you can do! 
Forever. Tennis forever. That's the most time. Seems to be a bug. This is Alright, better. Yeah, there seems to be a bug with Goku versus Kamisalin where they continue to fight like this and evade each other forever. We will stop this battle. Didn't have that issue with Vegeta versus Anod 18 or in the first battle. I don't know why it happens now. But it's not very fun to watch that. Okay, so there are there is a bug yeah, that they may uh, end up in a loop like that. Try some other characters. Son Goku. Teen Goku. Versus someone. Okay, Piccolo. Be an ally of Goku. And enemy. If they remove the Cyberman, so we'll pick Reddit, I guess. It's the enemy. Change the song. too many songs it's difficult to, to find the one you want this one is good you'll pick it the planes that's the right stage against Raditz I think this mod has better resolution than the other person that I played the hack the graphics just look better on the stages and the Super Saiyans don't look as glitched. There's no, uh, like, uh, I don't remember the word, ghosting effect like they had in the other version. There was a slight ghosting effect. This mod, uh, Dragon Ball Super Saiyan GT4, there seems to be no ghosting effect with the Super Saiyans, which is very good. And the stages are also not as bugged. They look much better here. The planes look really good. So yeah, I, I recommend playing uh, <laughs> playing the Dragon Ball Super Getting the 4 mod on the on an emulator over over and over the hack because the hack has um, problems with the graphics that the, the mod doesn't have for some reason. I have the same settings the emulator I haven't changed it so I, I guess the, the mod has been uh, better 
uh, adjust uh, to the emulator. It's, it's uh, better optimized for the PC SX2 emulator and the PlayStation 2. Ah, they also had that loop situation. Yeah, the, the mod has a problem with the AI doing this too long. Too long. Never happened in the hack. But yeah, uh, the, the graphics look way better in the, in the mod. Stages and the characters are less bugged. In the emulator. But it's not great that we have this issue here. Yeah. At least not when watching the AI. The issue with the endless loops um, didn't happen in the original game. So is it some old uh, issue, I believe? They're supposed to interrupt that loop sooner. Right, right, it's won against Goku. He also needs to defeat Piccolo. Yeah, I really like that the stages do not look bugged in this version. They are very clear, like with the PlayStation Portable game. But better because the PlayStation 2 used this better graphics compared to the PlayStation Portable. Even when you use an emulator, I believe the emulator for the PlayStation Portable makes it 10 times as good as the PlayStation Portable. But uh, it still looks way better uh, worse than the PC 6 2 emulator. Bath is uh, uh, quite entertaining to watch, I think, in this game, uh, when they work. I used, used to watch uh, a lot of battles when I was a kid, or a teen, I was like between 12 and 17, when Budoka 1 to Tenkechi 3 released. <coughs> Budokai 1 released in 2002 in December or November and uh, that's the first one I bought and uh, Tenkichi 3 I believe released in November 2007 so between uh, November 2002 and November 2007 they released these games Of course, in the PlayStation 2, they, they the games have very various resolution. On the computer, I have the benefit of using my computer's graphics card, which enhances the graphics by a lot. And also, the emulator allows you to, to use it. And, uh, and uh, the emulator itself makes the graphics better than on the PlayStation 2. Okay, um, <coughs> but the mod, I believe, it's from 2017 or something. 
Uh, but the latest release is probably a very recent, probably from last year or so. And I believe the older versions were in Spanish. So this is one of the first versions with English language. I believe the other versions had Spanish or Japanese you could choose between. Uh, this one has English or Japanese, I believe. Raditz won against the boat. Alright. Yeah, very impressive mod without graphical issues, which is really nice to, to see. Okay. <coughs> Heroes. <coughs> Tien, Shotsu, Krillin, Kid, Gohan. And Jairobe. Yamcha died against the Cyberman. So we pick Jairobe instead. And uh, we do not have any Cybermen, so that's why we will pick Raditz in their place. And then we will uh, we'll pick Nappa, the second guy. And then we will pick Vegeta, Scout Vegeta. Alright, and that's it. <coughs> and their stage would be uh, would be the same stage actually. Different song. Okay, this song is good. It fit when Nappa killed the heroes, I believe. It was playing like when Nappa killed them in the cinematic in Budokai One, I believe. Love the stages here. You're going to die, fool. This happens, it never happened in the other hack where they continue like this forever. A weird issue. In this mode it can go forever, it seems. Try to change the difficulty. I might be the C difficulty. I don't know if it's a new difficulty for the mod. We go back to battle settings. So we have easy difficulty, normal difficulty, hard, very hard, and C. I don't know if C is new and hard, very hard is the old maximum. Could be. Then it might be the new battle difficulty that is causing that issue. We'll see. Might still happen to we'll see. Okay, right again. Ah! 
You're going to die, fool. Yeah. <laughs> 
Ah, Johan has a tail. He didn't in the original, I believe. Tail is new to the mod, I suspect.
tillbaka till damaged form. Där är det är Efter det här tillbaka. He will lose. No, he will turn into a great ape. Nice. Happened when he had no health left. He might still lose the battle. Yeah. He didn't get new health. That's what happens when you pick on my dad. He, auto he automatically turned into a great ape when his health reached zero, but or almost zero. It was too late. He didn't get more health after the transformation. So. Okay. Joke of all Saiyans. My name is Goku, and I'm from Earth. Kakarot versus um, the Goku versus Turtles. Okay. <coughs> so hack obviously has way more models and characters. Every skin is a new character, pretty much. Almost. This mod has fewer characters. It doesn't have the soldiers, the turtles, and such. It doesn't have all the minor characters. Like the movies and so. Replace the Dragon Ball, the Dragon Ball characters with the super, super ones. Most of them. Damage too. Okay. Damaged form. Okay.
we can't select characters more than once in this mod either. That's a feature I like of the hack. Should add that to this mod. It's, it's done by, I believe, editing the ROM file. The tool. So you can select the same character more than once. You can have same five Gokus, for example, in fight. Here you can't select the same character more than once. Okay. Wasteland is a different stage, we'll take it. didn't look as good. It had that issue in the background. The other stage looked better. This was a new stage, I believe. The planes. This is the old stage. I mistook the other one for this one. This one looks worse. Okay, Krillin versus Slug or Lord Slug. See you again. His attack there is more effective in this mod, I believe. He did way more of those. I don't remember the name of the attack. That endless loop uh, issue seems to have been fixed by playing on very hard and not on C difficulty. So the C difficulty caused that for the AI, I think. Damaged. Not in. Oh, 
kill you on one. So if I have transformations on, it would seem that uh, they lose because they always have very little health left when they transform. Like they're almost dead when they transform. Um, and I can't select the same character twice. So I can't have the, the evolution of the character join after the, the first one. Like I did with hack. So for example, with the hack I could select this guy, slug, and then I could select the, se the second character could select his evolution, guy and slug. But in, in, in this mod, we can only select him once. If I select this character, then I can't select the same character again. So I can't have his evolution join. I can't select this guy. So, uh, I, I believe the hack used a, an editor the, to, to edit the ROM to enable uh, multiple selections of the same character. I, th I think this mod should add that. Alright, but we've seen enough of the mod. We'll probably make another video later. See you later, bye.